Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? Let us pray. We thank you, Lord, for this day. We bless your holy name. Let then now the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my Redeemer. Amen. Our scripture for the short homily in this morning is comes from John 1, verse 5, and reads as follow. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness have not overcome it. The scripture that was read speaks about the light in the darkness that could not be overcome by darkness. We know that light eliminates darkness. No matter the amount of darkness, it can be eliminated by even a small little light. Darkness thus have no power over light. No matter the amount of darkness there might be, in a blink of an eye, light can remove the darkness. We, as a country in the world, are at present time experiencing a darkness, COVID-19. A darkness as never experienced before. A darkness that had killed thousands of people worldwide. We read in John 8 verse 12 the following. When Jesus spoke to the people again, he said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. We as his children know that the Lord is our light and he brings his light into our darkness. We therefore are assured that through his word that he will bring his light into even this darkness that we are experiencing at present. We as his children does not have to fear the darkness, for he has already overcome the darkness of the grave to live and reign forevermore. And so his light will light our way yet again in this darkness we are experiencing at present. Let his light shine for us. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, our God and Saviour, we thank you that we are reminded that the light of you that you bring into our lives can extinguish, it can eliminate any amount of darkness. Jesus, bring your light into our worried hearts over this pandemic, this darkness that we are experiencing so that we can see again anew your hope, mercy, and loving kindness towards us. Hear our prayers, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. We will now listen to a short piece of a song by Andre Krauts, The Lord is My
Let's receive the benediction. And now may the love, hope, and mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ shine into our lives now and forevermore. Amen.